It was a moment of much tears running down the, ch the cheeks of Christian leaders, parents and relatives as they prayed for the freedom of the 121 students kidnapped in Kaduna State. The special prayer session is coming barely a week after gunmen attacked the Bethel Baptist High School. Habila Darofai's report is presented in our studios. The National President of Baptist Convention other heads of interdenomination churches and Christians are joining the parents and relatives of the students of Bethel Baptist High School as they converge to pray for the freedom of adopted students. The black they are putting on is an indication of how they feel in their hearts. The president of Baptist Convention, Reverend Dr. Israel Lakonji, says members of the denomination all over the world are praying simultaneously for God's intervention. We do not believe that people should be taken who are free and then you should go and pay for them. That is our position. We do not believe in that. We do not practice it. We have not been doing that. Um, like I said, for 166 years now, we have operated secondary schools in Nigeria. It has never happened that our children will be taken away. And now that they have t been taken away, we have called upon God that God should intervene. The Cardinal State Chairman of Christian Association of Nigeria, Reverend Joseph Hayab, adds that the states need to do better at being on the offensive in tackling kidnapping. The Kaduna State, you all know that our governor has been governing us with propaganda. Yes. Yes, sir. He said what he cannot do. Yes. He intimidates our pastors. Your pastors, my pastors are afraid to tell him the truth. I feel sad and I feel bitter. But when I turn around, I give God the praise. Yes, because it's the distance I've taken all the way from Lagos to bring my child here. But I'm not regretting it at all. I'm not regretting it. If the school will stand, my son also will stand with the school. The principal of the school, evidently emotional, recounts her experience on the day the students were kidnapped. No parents, when you are crying on one day, even I, I don't think even my person had my voice. I have to cry for 121. You are only crying for your child, but I'm crying for 121 because they are all mine. About 150 students were taken from the school last week and 28 escaped, leaving 121 in custody. The Baptist Convention says it's not the church's practice to pay ransom. Having God and no guns, the only way for the church and the school is prayer and the power in it. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.